We at Sylvius do our best to keep our producers appraised of the latest and best products for risk management on the market today. Well, Farm Revenue Protection is an exciting new insurance program available for the 2016 crop year nationwide. Whole Farm Revenue Protection was authorized in the 2014 Farm Bill. It was designed to provide insurance for all commodities on the farm under one insurance policy. Growers of grain crops, specialty crops, and various other ag-related commodities will now have the ability, for the first time, to participate in highly subsidized federal crop insurance programs. The product of adjusted gross revenue, also known as AGR, which is what Whole Farm Revenue Protection was modeled after, had both a limited geography and a million dollar cap for gross income. These two things combined made the program only effective for select growers. Whole Farm Revenue Protection is the replacement for AGR in a much wider geography. With some of the lowest rates and highest subsidies in all of crop insurance, a $10 million cap and widespread availability makes the Whole Farm Revenue Protection Plan a great option for many producers. So how does Whole Farm Revenue Protection work? Let me explain. Whole Farm Revenue Protection actually ensures your revenue, the first to do so. It starts with your last five years of Schedule F income averaged out. Your Schedule F records are required. Then you compare your historical gross income average to your expected revenue for the next crop year, which is very similar to filling out an acreage report ahead of time. One great benefit is that Whole Farm is the first product to ensure actual revenue based off of real numbers, not an indexed income value like in the past. So in our example, we're expecting to plant 1,000 acres of corn, 175 bushels an acre, for $4 a bushel. 1,000 acres of soybeans, 50 bushels an acre at $9.50, and 350 acres of green beans at about 5 tons an acre, $300 a ton. Add another 75 acres of apples at 900 bushels an acre with an $8 price tag. Take your expected acres, multiply them with your expected production, times the current cash prices, and you get the total expected revenue, in this example, 2.2 million. So after you've calculated your expected income and then compared it to your five-year average, the whole farm revenue policy dictates we take the lower of the two numbers. Once the appropriate revenue is set, you will choose an insurance level. Here is a subsidy chart to consider. As you will see, the more commodities you grow, the higher the subsidy rate and available coverage options become. Achieving a third commodity count becomes very important for the whole farm revenue policy. It allows you to buy the highest levels of coverage and qualifies you for the highest subsidy available. In our example, we will choose 80% coverage because with four commodities to count for, our grower qualifies for the highest level of coverage and the highest subsidy percent. Our coverage, just shy of $1.8 million at 80%, and with a subsidy of 71%, gives us a producer premium of only $16,000. That's $6.75 an acre to insure $1.79 million in revenue, a rate of 0.9%. That's right, 0.9. I'm sure you can see why we're excited to offer this new plan to farmers. Additionally, purchasing multi peril crop insurance alongside your whole farm revenue protection plan further lowers your premium. This is one of the cheapest rates in all of crop insurance. Let me give you another example of a quote to one of our customers. This producer has corn, seed corn, and soybeans, and is able to insure $5.5 million in revenue, 75% coverage for only $45,000 in premium. With the lending environment tightening, this policy could make a difference for you and your ag lender. One more example. This farmer planted corn, mint, and soybeans, and he was able to insure $497,000 for a $3,700 premium. Whether you're a small specialty crop grower or a large acreage grain producer, whole farm revenue protection could be an excellent fit for your operation. We are excited to offer this new program and we hope we can serve you in the future.